Good day, thank you for tuning in to SJ336, St. John 336. As you know, that is the warning about faith. He that believeth in the Son hath everlasting life, and he that believeth not the Son shall not see life, but the wrath of God abideth on him. The Gospel according to St. John. <coughs> Chapter 3, verse 36. I am Stephanie Jeanette, Stephanie Jeanette Bradley, and I'm presenting via YouTube my uh, daily devotional book designed to have you desire to study the Word of God for yourself uh, and regularly, daily, regularly, <clears throat> daily, regularly with your family, with your friends, with your husband, with your wife. Uh, <clears throat> that is heterosexual marriage. And so I've decided to present it on YouTube. We're on day 372, which covers Psalm 131, which is a very short psalm. Not as short as 117, but still very short. So the suggested scriptural references are St. John 13, verses 1 to 17, with emphasis on verses 3 and 4, Romans 12, verse 2, 2 Corinthians 2, verse, uh, 2 Corinthians, I'm sorry, <clears throat> chapter 13, verse 5, the book of John, <clears throat> James, chapter 2, verse 18, the book of Leviticus, chapter 19, verse 15, and the book of Luke, the Gospel according to St. Luke, chapter 6, verses 23 to 36. So I'm just going to read a select <clears throat> few of those. <clears throat> Let's give uh, 13, 3, and 4 a whirl in St. John. St. John 13, 3, and 4. Jesus, knowing that the Father had given all things into his hands, and that he was come from God and went to God, he riseth from supper and laid aside his garments and took a towel and girded himself. <coughs> Romans 12, 2. And be not conformed to this world, but be transformed by the renewing of your mind, that you may prove what is that good and acceptable and perfect will of God. Second Corinthians 13, 5. Examine yourselves, whether you be in the faith. Prove your own selves. Know ye not your own selves? How that Jesus Christ is in you, except you be reprobate. And so James, chapter 4, verse 1. Right after Hebrews, James 2.18. Yea, a man may say, Thou hast faith, and I have works. Show me thy faith without thy works, and I will show thee my faith by my works. And, and the suggested... Um, praise song for today precious lord take my hand by kelly price the youtube upload is dated april 5th 2012 that was my mom's favorite okay <clears throat> what happened oh yeah i should have noticed that so anyway my little doodad here has me on day 400 and Okay, so 70, day 372, Psalm 131, scriptural references, this is a correction, but I'm not going to read any of them at this point. Uh, Psalm 131, James 4, 1 to 3, Proverbs 20, verse 11, and 6, verse 11, and then chapter 16, verse 18. St. Matthew 18, 3, 1 Samuel 1, 22, 2 Samuel 22, 27, verses 27 to 29. St. Mark 10, verse 15, and Romans 12, verse 3. We actually did read that one, didn't we? Romans 12, 3. <clears throat> okay. 
No, okay, I, I read the one before it, so. And be not conformed to this world, and be transformed by the renewing of your mind, that you may prove what is that good and accept and perfect will of God. Three, for I say, through the grace given unto me, to every man, to every man that is among you, not to think of himself more highly than he ought to think, think but to think soberly, according as God hath dealt to every man the measure of faith. So don't um, overexert yourself in the faith muscle department. Um, it's kind of hard to gauge, right? Like, when do you, how do you know when you are not having faith? Or if you're having faith that's uh, pretentious. Great. You yeah, got one of those freaking bugs on my wall. Gosh darn it. Son of a freaking heater. Oh, I did my heater last night. Not last night, the night before. <sighs> anyway, I'm going to have to. All right, so let me read this. This is getting to be long, and I haven't said anything. The song, uh, this song of three verses, reads like a swift prayer at the entrance of battle. In it, the writer discusses his humility and dependence on the Lord our God, which he encourages all of Israel to hope in the same. By the phraseology of verse two, it would seem that the psalmist is desirous to impress upon his wife and and or his inner circle that this situation which he's about to address is not born out of selfish desires, but instead springs forth dutifully from a place of stability and, and righteousness. And the song is Covenant Keeping God by Sunny Badu. YouTube upload dated September 2nd, 2010. Intercessory prayer. Dear Father God Almighty, our ever-present help, we thank you for your dear and only begotten Son and his completed work of his shed blood on the cross at Calvary in Christ Jesus of Nazareth. But God, please exercise in us your word that our yea be yea and our nay be yea as we interchange one with another. As, our, as we are all created in your blessed image. And Lord God Almighty, please bless us with the discovery of the cause of Chagrin's disease and a successful adult cure, not necessarily in that order. In Christ Jesus' holy and precious name we do pray. Amen. And thank you for tuning in. Please like, share, subscribe, and comment below. I monitor all comments.